sir, we have expert, Dr. Subhi Chaudhary as oh, AI wow. expert. Oh, wow. Wow. So, Dr. <laughs> Chaudhary, then I think I, I, I'm going to eat your head <laughs> later on. <laughs> welcome, welcome anytime. So, uh, I mean, that's, that's the call of the time. And uh, I, I thought that since uh, very limited work has happened on this area, and it's a very novel subject also. So, uh, let me try. So, uh, I have, in fact, presented a couple of papers uh, in a few of the conferences. Great. There is one conference which is also happening in IIM Nagpur uh, two months later. I'm also Great. presenting it there. Uh, let's see, like you know, how it goes. I'm, I'm hopeful that some good uh, learning will emerge out of. Uh, the uh, Pradeep sir has uh, joined as participant. Is it possible for us to elevate him? Okay, okay, I'm doing yeah, that. Uh, Sumit can do it. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And and uh, can can uh, can I also be the uh, host or something so that I can run my PPTs? Uh, yes, sir. If you want, you can share with us or you can share because you have the share rights with you. I have, right? Yeah, uh, you the have. Only, I mean, I, I yeah, Lenica is going to share want, uh, all the slides and test ones, probably. Yeah, I, I definitely will uh, share the slides uh, through Pradeep. The only thing is uh, uh, it has some links and all right now. So that's the reason it's better that I offer it from my laptop. Otherwise, then mm -hmm. it will be yours. Yeah, you have the share rights, sir, with you. And uh, we are, uh, sir, uh, we have just the flow of the event, which I'm going to share with you. Uh, we begin with uh, uh, just opening remarks, uh, very quick re opening remarks from uh, Abhinan, sir, and uh, Pradeep, sir. And then we hand over the charge to one of our students. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, yes, sir, uh, today negotiation is the topic which is very, very close to us uh, for the sake of everyone, uh, which actually is, in fact, I feel that... Uh, uh, our life is a negotiation between life and death. Right. And uh, if life wins, that means, uh, uh, you know, death is not near to us. So negotiation yeah. is going on between life and death also. So okay. negotiation and, uh, and interpersonal skills, basically yes. interpersonal skill is the focus area of Parag sir today. And uh, he has done so many, uh, uh, you know, this uh, experience also he has in this area. So I hand over the chance to Abhinan sir for uh, setting the context and Pradeep sir will also throw light on the opening remarks uh, and then we'll have your introduction sir, official introduction through one of our uh, uh, students that is um, uh, Chitrangi. Uh, we are joined by Dr. Bharti Dave. I welcome uh, Madam also. She's Dean School of Science. Hello Madam. And uh, we are expecting any time. <laughs> We are expecting nice anytime uh, Dean School of Engineering, also Dr. Amish Vyas. He is just through with uh, his, one of his webinars. So quickly over to Avinan sir for uh, uh, throwing light on interpersonal skills, which is key for career growth and especially for students. Over to Avinan sir. Good morning to you all students. Uh, welcome back again to this Turning Point webinar series, which is being taken care of by our LND team at Cadilla Pharmaceuticals. And I Again, support and thank you Pradeep ji for bringing a very good speaker to all the students to make them groom in their career life. You know, when we were engineers in 98, we were not being given such a bandwidth of getting into management topics like interpersonal skill, negotiation skills. We learned over a period you know, through management courses and other part of it. And later on in the life, I realized these skills are more important compared to the technical streams when you move ahead in the management ladder and that's what is going to take you to the next level. If you look at the management skills, I will say that negotiation skills, I will go to back to our founder chairman, I am Modi sir, a very humble person and his skills of negotiations were very good in terms of how to uh, tackle with the doctors and other part of it. And coming back to Dr. Modi, he says supercharged negotiation when it comes to dealing with any joint venture. You know, fast forward, he will put his uh, stand in such a way that any chess player can be defeated. So thus, these skills are much more important for anybody and it is a learning phase of it. You will not learn as such, you have to learn through wisdom, through some of your seniors, some of your gurus and that's how you will learn that skills and it will help. Today, there are specialized negotiations in foreign affairs. 
who will deal with this take it the examples of uh, negotiation skills in kandara break it how you are going to deal with hostages there are special interpersonal skills for that and you look at the interpersonal skills on joint venture because there the cultural differences is coming today if i am making a jv with japan there is a different cultural aspect to it if you doing it with russia there is a different aspect to cultural uh, thought process is coming so everywhere it is different you cannot have a same thought process everywhere and such skills are very much required for any international affairs i was specifically taught these skills when i was there in abn amro when we were in the abn amro bank of preferred banking uh, everybody in the preferred banking were being taught with negotiation and interpersonal skills because we are dealing with high profile clients so who are not less than mercs you know of the world or maybe the all the golf clubs players so when you are dealing with such high profile player what kind of negotiations or how interpersonal skills you have to have with you the soft skills and the hard skill both come into play and how you are going to project nowadays your interpersonal skills in terms of presentation today if you look at your presentation it has to be high funda presentation so that interpersonal skills in coming to soft skills on zoom most of the time so these are all thought process which comes into picture how you are dressed how you are going to make a shake and everything is clubbed into this interpersonal skills and it is a wholesome persona which is being developed through such skills so you are a part of it and not taking much of the time putting back to pradeep ji and parag ji for such a enthusiastic session thank you thank you abhinand sir over to pradeep sir thank you so much uh, dr amrita for uh, this opportunity uh, thank you uh, good morning dr bharti good morning abhinand sir uh, good morning uh, somit ji uh, it is always a pleasure and my special good morning to parag sir so it's always my pleasure and i always become very happy motivators also need motivation so i get the same type of motivation when i come here so it's very good always so today uh, we are going to listen from mr parag bhat kai bar hota hai ki kai log uh, kafi cheeze bolte hain kai bar hota hai ka kafi log wo cheeze khud pe uh, lagu karte hain kyunki bolna aasan hai kehna bahut aasan hai lekin khud pe wo cheez implement karna bahut mushkil hai to kai log wo cheez jeete hain सो so, पराग सर के बारे में बिल्कुल बोल सकता हूँ टॉपिक उन्होंने चुना है या सिलेक्ट किया है कि वो खुद उसका बहुत बड़ा एग्जांपल है एंड इट्स इट्स माय एडवाइस टू एवरीवन आई नो हिम ही इज़ अ वेरी डाउन टू अर्थ वेरी हम्बल पर्सन यू विल ऑलवेज सी हिम एनी वन इन दैट मैनर सो आई ऑलवेज अप्रीशियटी आई एम नॉट सेट ओपनली इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू बट आई एम अडन एडमायर uh there so thank you so much for accepting this invitation and being part of this uh today's topic as i say uh, forget about iqs today if your emotional quotient is not good today if you are not able to keep up the relationship with anyone you are not going to get success aap kitne bhi intelligent ho sakte ho aap kitne bhi smart ho sakte ho but agar aapka networking ya logon se aapko milne julne ki kshamta aapki nahi hai ya logon se aap theek se baat nahi karte ho ya logon se aap sampark nahi rakh sakte ho especially from the last covid time that we have seen so i think uh, the success will never come so whatever iq or whatever marks a person scores if he has a poor relationship uh, with the uh, fellows or the peers or with the colleagues and the friends he can never get success and the greatest example is gold medalist doctors if you go and visit the gold medalist doctor they are always be silent sitting in silos wherein other doctors will have a huge practice why because they don't have this kind of uh, ego i'll say because sometime uh, vidya should give vinay but sometime vidya gives that ego so that should not happen i think today's topic is very very apt sir so unfortunately sir i am into a training program uh, i'll not be able to listen it live but i will definitely watch a recording of it we have a facility of recording so i'll definitely like to watch recording thank you so much parag sir for again being part of this and accepting this invitation thank you so much sir thank you pradeep sir i think this webinar today is a result of interpersonal skills you have developed with all the kerala speakers and uh, that is how we were able to uh, bring in you know parag bhat sir over here so i salute to your interpersonal skills as well and uh, to abhinand sir also that he is instrumental between indrashil university and uh, kerala of course uh, now i invite uh, one of our students chitrangi to introduce the speaker today chitrangi you can unmute yourself yes ma'am 
my greetings to one and all presenting and attending the webinar i am chitrangi vaghwaria from bsc bioscience i am here to introduce today's speaker mr parag bhat sir he is a certified icf coach psychometric expert instructional designer and neuro linguistic professional he is the author of book change sustained he is a phd scholar with pandit din dayal energy university having masters in hrd he has over 21 years of experience in retail pharma and consulting he has trained people in india as well as overseas he designed and conducted over 20 assessment and development centers so here to discuss the approach and various strategies i invite parak sir so a warm welcome to you over to you sir thank you chitrangi and uh, thank you uh, all the learned and experienced people who are uh, leading the learning show of uh, inrashil university and uh, this is also a privilege to me that uh, i could interact with uh, uh, all all the Uh, teachers professors uh, of indrashil university uh, i personally believe that uh, uh, you know you people are really lucky uh, as students uh, because uh, when we were uh, learning you know our even i'm talking about masters uh, uh, our conceptual understanding was various things were uh, not as strong as probably you would be having and that's all credit goes to the efforts of uh, the gurus who all are sitting over here because uh, what i see is that they are setting up a visionary approach towards your career growth uh, and why i'm saying so is because uh, uh, if i if i uh, admit one thing uh, you know uh, to to all of you we have learned interpersonal uh, uh, most likely kinesthetically i can say you know Uh, we have learned the interpersonal with the experience of ours you know so we we have had good experiences we have had bad experiences and with all those experiences we uh, designed our own theory around uh, you know how we can gel well with people and that's how we have grown very later stage then like you know we uh, got the formal learning on variety of things and that's how they like so all things put together uh, we understood that what are the right way of dealing with people and what are the wrong ways of it so probably uh, how i can uh, bring it to uh, all of you is let me tell you that uh, uh, interpersonal sahi mein agar bolne jaao to i mean I, i'm sure that abhinan sir and uh, namrata madam and bharti madam and all sumit sir they will agree that kai bar na puri zindagi nikal jati hai aapko samajh mein nahi aata ki interpersonal hota kya hai कई कई बार लोग जीते हैं मर जाते हैं उनको मतलब यू नो पीपल आर नॉट कंफर्टेबल विद दोस काइंड ऑफ पर्सनालिटीज बिकॉज दे प्रोबेबली हैव नॉट प्रॉपर ओरिएंटेशन टुवर्ड्स सेंसिटिविटी अराउंड देयर एनवायरनमेंट राइट एंड एंड इंटरपर्सनल इज इज ऑल अबाउट दैट सो यू नो आई एम आई एम वेरी हैप्पी दैट यू आर यू आर गेटिंग दिस अपॉर्चुनिटी एक घंटे में टू बी वेरी ऑनेस्ट what probably i can give you is uh, an orientation towards it uh, i can provide some insights around it and uh, then like you know it's up to you how you would like to take it forward uh, uh, but but of course you will get a very clear cut path in terms of uh, what is this and how you can develop it so uh, allow me to now uh, you know share the slide is this uh, visible to all yes sir very nice so uh, i would wish like you know that instead of uh, one person speak and all uh, let this be uh, an interactive one so uh, i would like to understand from the students that why do you want to learn uh, you know the concepts of interpersonal kyun sikhna chahte ho students you can uh, drop in your expressions on the in the chat box or q and a box also. yes yes i i i'll be able to read so no problem yeah my question is that aaj kyu hum ye seekh rahe hain kyu aapko aap apne apna time yahan pe invest kar rahe ho like you know it's almost around an hour that we will be here why do you want to learn this
uh, students, if you can hear us, please uh, share your reflections in the chat box or Q&A box. They are holding mobile, sir. So probably it's very oh. difficult to type on a mobile. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay. Yes. okay. Okay, no problem. But, sir, but let's India, try. Sir, there is one reflection to learn the oh, talent yes. and communication. Absolutely. So uh, uh, talent actually is basically the group of uh, certain skills that uh, we, we learn over a period of time. And uh, uh, I, I really appreciate, I think this is uh, Kshipra. Right, so uh, I, I completely agree with you that interpersonal, you know, is all about communication. Uh, the problem of Mahabharata, if you actually see in the root cause, uh, communication, you know, uh, not being able to speak the uh, right thing at the right time, that was actually the root cause of Mahabharata. Of course, there were certain other issues as well, uh, but. Communication was also, I mean, there, are, there were certain things that some of the characters have said, and because of that, it hurt, and that's how, like, you know, the Mahabharata was created. And so, so just understand uh, and imagine the power of communication in the interpersonal, which actually either create great things in your life, or it can definitely completely damage your life. So... Uh, very, very good uh, input, Shibra. Uh, yes, uh, uh, you could actually learn the talent of communication if you have a vision of developing an interpersonal skill. All right. So uh, we will we will also, and, and the rest of the people uh, can also keep on adding whenever you are comfortable to add, right? Uh, welcome, Shibra. So uh, let me tell you, friends, that what happens is that... Uh, since you are a student and ultimately you are learning uh, all those things, not only to make your life better, but of course you are doing it so that you can be a successful professional. Now, when it comes to profession, what happens that when you start your career, you start as an individual contributor, right? Of course, then there are peer levels that you have to manage, but uh, in, in uh, greater sense, it is the individual contributor role. You only and only grow if uh, you showcase your competencies beyond your subject matter so or, or beyond your functional skill. And what is this beyond? This beyond is basically how people see you, how people perceive you, how people engage with you. This is very, very important for you to grow in your career. And... Uh, let me tell you that uh, you know, Pradeep and team, uh, they also conduct something called as 360 degree feedback for all the Cadilla leaders <laughs> across. And that's all because you accept and let somebody grow as a leader only if you find that the person is very well accepted across the board. Because just imagine that if you have a leader who doesn't have an acceptance across the board, the person will never be able to lead the team. So for anybody to grow in life, the interpersonal is something which is very, very important, especially like you know, as you develop from an individual contributor to a supervisory role, from a supervisory to a managerial role, and from a managerial to a leadership role. So in all these things, what is something which is going to be the success factor for you is interpersonal. That precisely, my friends, the reason for each one of us to be sensitive about interpersonal and to learn the interpersonal skill, right? Now, having this uh, understanding, let's move on. The second question comes is then, what are the components which builds interpersonal? This is something that like, you know, all of us are here today to kind of uh, uh, exchange our thoughts in terms of what and how do I do that? How do I build these things within me, right? So there are certain components that we need to understand according to me. So uh, I once again uh, come and uh, uh, would like, uh, you know, if possible, uh, you to participate. I will show you some pictures now and I want you to uh, give me the answers as to what do you see in these pictures, okay? 
So uh, try and attempt, very easy, not, not so difficult at all, okay? So first picture I'm going down. Look at this picture and tell me where this person is looking at. It's an interesting, yeah, it part. is interesting, you know, uh, the students for you all. Just see and uh, be quick in answering. It's more or less like a quiz, you know. Absolutely. And, and this is nothing about general knowledge. What, according to you, that's what I want to know. I once again would like to show it to you. Where do you see this person is looking at? Anybody can attempt. So to me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Shipra has uh, again quick, you know, in reply. According to, yeah. In so uh, I think she's good uh, her, uh, on her mobile. I don't know how Maybe she's Maybe fast, fast also. Right. So there is another uh, reflection, sir. Love is saying that uh, it's looking at both the direction, is that really possible? Yes. Okay, and uh, we see at the front. Okay, so we will, we will look into the answers later, but I, I hope that all of you are enjoying and now let's move on and let's see another picture. What do you see in this picture? What is this? Students, quick. This also shows your attentiveness also. Consider this as your entrance exam. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sooner or later they are going to, you know, face all this thing. Quick, anyone? Shipra, don't hesitate, even if you are, you know, trying every time and love. Yeah, we will give you an award at the end. <laughs> and I. She and I, okay. Okay, so now, now we are getting into And I uh, and Tornado uh, from Upper Side. Oh, okay, okay. So now I want to uh, show you what exactly is that. This is not an eye, it's a kitchen sink. If you now look at it, uh, you know, uh, with your focus, this yeah. is not an eye, it's a kitchen sink. <laughs> yeah, the throat. <laughs> Madam also is, you know, enjoying. <laughs> okay. We always fear that. We always fear that uh, it may be wrong. That is why in the, in that, it's fear, perhaps and that's the fun. Attempt. Yeah, that's, that, that's the fun. You know, uh, we, we play Damshara and in most of the time we can't uh, make it. Yes. Uh, what's the name of the film? So consider right. this like that. We all are a family. I mean, I'm not a professor from outside. I'm from the Kettler family. Okay. Now, the next question is, how many people do you see here? Sir, uh, we couldn't even see it. It's in I'm a, sorry. <laughs> in a blink of eye. Uh, How many people do you see here? Sir, so four many people are... and four pillars. And the then... answer is there is nobody there. Yeah, zero is the there. Pillars only. Yeah, someone has reset, sir. Zero. Yes. So, so uh, appreciate. Uh, who is the person? Just one second. Uh, Mehul 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 Mehul. Okay. Okay. So good. Uh, good attempt. Now let's see the next. What do we see? What do you see in this picture? Now we have become even more attentive, sir. <laughs> <laughs> and alert so that, you know, we are right. In yeah. What do you see in this picture? Quick students, come on. And I really appreciate that uh, people are participating and I'm very happy about it. Yes, sir. Don't be... Make an attempt. Make an uh, attempt. Bird. Uh, yes. Okay. Hand. Okay. So, thank you, Monal. Who else would like to attempt? He's from uh, BSc Chemistry, Daduk Monal. Oh, okay. The love is from Engineering. Shipra from oh. MSc. Wow. Uh, spider. MSc, spider in, in the, the eye. eye. Oh. Good. So, Good so imagination. See, look at look at the imagination. <laughs> imagination. True, sir, true. And and nothing wrong about it. Now let me show it to you. This is a lady who has been painted all over her body, and therefore it looks like a bird. Can you see that? So it so there is a there is a pillar uh, like a structure on which the lady is uh, giving a pause, 
yeah and uh, she has one leg folded another is straight and a hand over the head so we are not able to make it out oh okay so oh, now, now yes 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 <laughs> when we see attentiveness <laughs> yes <laughs> And in any case, I'm going to share this entire file with you people so sir, you can sir. enter on it. Sure, sir. You can, you can also use it wherever you Yeah, need. definitely, sir. We would like to. Okay, now next. What is the, this is a very old uh, photograph, by the way. What is the age of this lady? Come on, students. Predict. What is the age of this lady? Ninety. Okay. Twenty-two. Less than hundred. Twenty-two. Now see, look at the uh, and and uh, Amir uh, really appreciate. Look at look at the paradox approach from hundred to twenty-two. Yes. Ten to twelve. Oh my God. Sir, uh, I am actually happy to tell you that uh, even the faculties are involved here and oh, even please, they are trying please. to guess that. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be very happy. We'll be very happy. Consider this like a family discussion. Dr. Kiran, 90 and above. Sure, why not? Now, here, let me tell you, and first of all, uh, uh, thank you all for this lovely participation. I'm very happy about it. Uh, now, this is actually a very vague picture where actually the, the painter has painted two faces. So uh, let me see if I can activate. Uh, and trying to, uh, sir, they are justify also because they are looks of two ladies, you know, so absolutely. that is. <laughs> so now let me, let me explain. The old lady, this is the nose, this is the lips. So this is very obvious, but the younger one is something that at times pe people can't make it. So this is actually the eye. This is a hair. So it's a side face. This, this is like you know chicken chin, right? So uh, and this is actually the ear. So now you can understand how this can be also a younger one. So nobody is wrong actually. Got this? All are correct, sir. All are correct. Yes. So good. So now uh, the the reason, my friends, uh, and why we have shown all these things, why we are discussing this, is because. Uh, everyone has seen these pictures with the mental frames that we were having in our mind, right? Which is called as perception, right? Uh, now, how we build this perception with different learning, which goes into our mind since our childhood, right? So we formally get ourselves educated. Then we also have life experiences. And at times the way we uh, see the things, okay? So, uh, wo apna ek television program aata hai, Tarak Mehta ka ulta chasma. Right? What does it mean is that we all have some glasses on our face. So, these glasses are basically the, the way we perceive things. Right? And many a times we perceive things not as the way it is, but the way we want to see it or the way we are looking at it. Right? So, uh, the, the importance of uh, this particular learning, my friend, is when we are talking about the component, one of the very fundamental component of interpersonal is we hold on to our perception. Our perception makes our judgments. And the problem uh, in most of the cases starts with we are holding on to our perception, we are holding on to our judgments. So what happens actually because of that is, number one, we miss the bigger picture, right? So because we, we see the things the way we see it and not the way or, or not what it is. Instead of a sink, I see an eye. Okay? Because that's what is the mental frame which I have in my mind. When I see something like this, it is this. Uh, that's the reason there are a lot of uh, theories that we have developed, right? Uh, at one end, if you actually see our country is a mix of uh, a variety of uh, you know, religion, which should be our strength, but many times it comes up as our weakness, is all because we are holding on to our perceptions. We are holding on to our judgments. We, in fact, uh, unfortunately, in our country, we have so many judgmental things. We judge people on the way they look. 
we judge people on the way they talk we judge people on variety of things but we don't see the reality inside them right i can give you n number of examples we don't have time but the problem with each one of us is that we uh, perceive things with our judgments right so so uh, we don't make an attempt to try and understand the other people the way they are so what happens is we we miss the bigger picture we miss the reality we also at times can go wrong about uh, taking decisions we can also hurt people and and ultimately we develop conflicts around us we we kind of gets into fights arguments and therefore at the end failure of the relationship right so the most fundamental thing that you need to start with is to get rid of being judgmental instead collect data collect information and be logical about thinking about somebody right so we have to come out of this thing so that's the first thing that we have to consider as a component now the second thing which is very important and uh, uh, all all the professors who are sitting here we have learned this this is a very old theory uh, that that like but this this is something which is very very solid right it's it's basically the transactional analysis so uh, friends kya hota hai ki each one of us irrespective of our age there are three ecosystems that we carry with us right which is called as the parent ego adult ego and child ego while the parent ego is all about being dominant caring and controlling child ego is all about submitting uh, you know you you look at the other persons to take the control and take the decision rather you do wherein adult ego is something where you consider the opposite person as equal as you right so therefore the the author who had written about it says that the best way to deal with each other is adult to adult right that that's the reason uh, uh, we are we are quite lucky now that for quite quite a few years the parenting also is changed the way we were brought up where like parents are always right uh, and and like you know you are supposed to learn but now in fact parents also have changed their style and they are also involving uh, their their kids into discussion in terms of ki uh, you know aapko kya lag raha hai aapko agar ye course lena hai to usse aapko kya lagta hai kya fayda ho sakta hai humko bola jata tha ki bhai aapke acche percentage aate hain to aapko science mein jana hai एवरेज कॉमर्स वाला और बाकी आर्ट्स में जाएगा एंड दैट्स हाउ इट वाज हमारे पास इतने ऑप्शंस भी नहीं थे टू बी वेरी ऑनेस नाउ यू आर लकी दैट यू हैव गॉट लॉट्स ऑफ ऑप्शंस इन योर करियर एंड एंड ऑफ कोर्स इन योर लाइफ राइट सो मेनी इयर्स बैक पीपल वर नॉट हैविंग चॉइसेस ओवर द लाइफ पार्टनर्स नाउ तो आई मीन इट्स ऑल वर्क टुगेदर अ डिफरेंट स्टोरी सो लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स हैव बीन चेंज बट द बॉटम लाइन इज दैट एडल्ट टू एडल्ट इज द राइट way of discussing and connecting with others so having this as a fundamental thing another theory was developed uh, using the same transactional analysis was by thomas harris and he wrote in a, even a book called as i am okay you are okay now what does it mean is that you actually perceive and you actually think of yourself and others in four different ways and that actually becomes a deciding factor for you to connect with others so say for an example in some situation you feel that you are also okay and the opposite person is also okay which is basically the adult to adult and the right thing to do wherein sometimes it may happen that you feel about yourself that you are not okay wherein you feel that the other person is okay so let's say for an example when you join industrial university it's your first day of the class and the knowledgeable teacher comes talking about an unknown subject you actually starts as if of course you are not okay in terms of having an understanding of a particular subject that's the re- reason you give a lot of respect your complete open ears to the teacher and the professor because you consider that professor and teacher as a learned person you consider that person as okay right so that's another uh, uh, level the third one 
wherein you believe that the opposite person is not okay, but you are okay. Yeah. And uh, what happens is that in that kind of a situation, you become a parent and you try and give the knowledge and experience to the other person rather receiving something from that person. And in the fourth one, which is called as, I am also not okay, you are also not okay. This is something where the relationship does not go anywhere. So what happens is, when we say that I'm okay and you are okay, you become assertive, right? You become happy, you become open to learn from others, as well as you are also courageous to give your own thought process to others. It's called an assertive behavior, yeah? Wherein, when you believe that you are not okay, but the opposite person is okay, right? What happens is that you become passive, right? And you become a little helpless also. When you believe that the other person is not okay, but you are okay, you become a, an aggressive person, okay? You develop an anger, especially when you see a failure of your positioning over the other. And when you believe that both the sides are not okay, what actually happens is that you keep things because confident right so the the discussion the relation goes nowhere right it's only the exchange of emotions and nothing else right you actually limit your discussion somewhere so uh, this is a very interesting uh, thing and i thought that as a student Probably what I should give you is some concepts which later on you can actually, uh, you know, I, I hope that probably you have some library or some sort of a thing where you can get some of these books and you can actually read those, where you can have a deeper understanding about it. Yeah. So uh, transaction analysis after the perception is the second thing that we should actually learn about. So what happens is when it comes to the negotiation, and we will also see another uh, conflict management uh, style related thing, but this is something which Robert Bernard has said that keeping this concept, how do you actually negotiate or how do you create situations in the negotiation? So when you say that you also win and I also win, you create a win-win situation because you see that in the negotiation situation, you find that the opposite person is also okay and you are also okay. But on the other side, when you believe that you don't have confidence on self, but you should win, right? What becomes is you have a win-lose situation. On the contradictory, the other side, you lose and win. And the last thing, which is like, you know, both the thing, people you believe are not okay, you actually tend to end with lose-lose relationship, right? So uh, the best scenario, Again, coming back to is adult to adult and believe that you are also okay and the opposite person is also okay. The objective of your all the negotiation is to ensure that both the sides win so that the relationship is intact, right? So that is basically the fundamental part that I thought that we should start with. So what happens is when you have the win and lose, you get into a compet, which means that when you want to win and you want the other person to lose, right? You gets into competition. This is how generally sometimes, like you know, when, when we go to buy and purchase something, you say that boss, ye mera bhav hai, isse aage main lunga. Nahi, aapko bechna hai to becho, varna mat becho. You don't bother about whether the opposite person is willing or losing. You gets into a competition. Okay, you are okay with the other person loses. It's like a court matter. Okay. Court matter, you don't see that the other person is winning or losing. You actually you want to win so you win. Right? So you get into a competition. When you look into a win-win, what you do is your attitude is accommodative. That the other person can be the same thing. Let me try and understand. When you get into lose-lose, what you actually do is you avoid it. You go away from the situation. You go away from the situation. Right? So you get into an avoidance behavior. Another lose-lose is compromise. Matlab, ya to aap dur chale jau, ya to aap compromise karke saath mein Right? Ye dono actually lose-lose hai. 
राइट कॉम्प्रोमाइज करके साथ में रहने में ना तो आप उस रिलेशनशिप को एंजॉय करते हो ना सामने वाला एंजॉय करते हो विन विन में क्या होता है कि विन विन में आप कलेबरेट करते हो या आप अकोमोडेट करते हो अकोमोडेट करने में सामने वाले को आप सेटिस्फाई करते हो बट टू सम एक्सटेंट यू मे ऑल्सो कॉम्प्रोमाइज हर इन कोलेबरेटिव सिचुएशन वॉट यू डू इज यू मेक दर्सन है स्टिल कॉम्प्रोमाइजिंग ऑन समथिंग एंड ब्रिंगिंग द बेस्ट एंड मोस्ट क्वालिटेटिव डिस्कशन which we will also learn uh, after some time so this is these are the basis of uh, you know the interpersonal now what we will go which probably will be more of your interest is what are the prerequisites isko hum log kaise theek kar sakte hain right because ab tak ki jo humne baat kiya hai wo ye baat kiya hai ki isse ye hota hai isse wo hota hai we haven't learned yet ki main kaise karu now we are getting into the things ki hum usko kaise kar sakte hain so Uh, I'm showing you a movie clip which I hope that you will enjoy. I'm sure, right? And then we will get into a discussion. I'll go back to play this. Uh, just one second. Probably yeah. I have not shared it right away. Uh, is the video and audio is fine yes sir okay. subit sir yes sir sir have you started any video i'm sorry have you started any video yes but we are not able to see ma'am can you see that no i can't oh 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 i'm sorry let me see what is the issue sir you have selected but uh, okay it is to be started sir if you wish you can send it to my email id i immediately i will uh, share with sumit sir he will share from here from our end yes yes that i really don't know what will be the size of the video and whether i can actually uh, but sorry. sumit sir can technically you can help it make it stop and then start the share button then you will be able to see the screen through youtube yeah yeah how it is now yeah now you can play Yeah, but then when I'm trying to play, it is. is this still like that yes sir sir uh, if my email id is there with you you can share that video with me okay and uh, from our end we can uh, share that sir okay ma'am let me just do a last try with this so mr sir you can directly uh, drop uh, email id with uh, yeah i'm the same thing man head office ne mujhe okay so what did we see in this uh, video by the time i once again upload the slide yes sir students and uh, my colleagues also can reflect you know yeah 
<laughs> for me based on whatever you uh, said sir uh, that was uh, ego coming in absolutely and uh, it was not adult ego it was some other kind of ego sir i can't <laughs> say had it been adult ego things absolutely. would have been different it would have been resulted differently absolutely absolutely thank you ma'am and uh, i i completely uh, agree that we actually uh, take our ego uh, into something in a relationship and then like you know it it spoils everything and uh, that's probably is is not the right thing so what is the base into it in any relation is the slide visible yes sir yeah so the base of any relationship comes with trust without trust we cannot build any relationship say for an example since morning of course uh, as usual we have a lot of things going on i have a team uh, that is working for me and we we have every day morning we have a meeting and in the evening we update each other as to what we have done right now imagine my friends that if i don't trust my team their capability and their intention i cannot do a multiplied work which is expected from my role as a leader yeah so uh, in any relationship be it personal or professional what is something which is the most fundamental pillar of any relationship is trust as hr unfortunately many a times i had to ask people to go and uh, when i have those uh, tough conversation with them what i have to tell them is that for any relationship if we don't have trust we can't stay with each other right we in fact many a times we experience integrity issues and all that we have to ask the person to go because if i don't trust i can't have that relationship right and ye jo kai sare relationship aajkal aise hi ban jate hain you know we see that people uh, have marriages for multiple times and all that uh, it was not so earlier right but nowadays people have opportunity to choose the life partner and still they are being failed yeah is all because uh, the most fundamental thing that they are missing into their life is trust so how do we develop this trust we can develop this trust of course right there are three elements to the trust one is you need to showcase your competence number two you need to showcase integrity in your relationship and number three you have to show a lot of intimacy in the relationship now why competence say for an example you will not trust me if you will not find sense into my content about interpersonal when i am talking right now my team will not trust me if i will not have you know walk the talk kind of a behavior wo fir bolenge ki ye bolta hai khud to kuch aur hi karta hai main agar unko bolunga boss subah time pe aana hai agar main hi nahi aaunga to that means i am not showing that worth of me agar main bolunga ki ye decision humko lena hi hai but agar main khud kabhi decision nahi dunga they will not trust right so showing competence competence show karne ke liye we have to be expert about our subject very thorough and that is where your professors are currently helping you in number 2 is we have to know that how do we impact to wherever that we are if parag bhat is talking about interpersonal i have to think about how do i impact through this presentation to your minds right and number 3 is we develop and we share our own view point agar hum nahi bolenge if we will not become assertive enough people will not find us competent as the reason jab bhi aapka placement wagera aayega to aap wo group discussion aur wo sab mein jate ho na why we do that is because you are getting an opportunity to showcase that you have a view point and you know how to showcase that yeah the second one is integrity integrity is something which is very very important in the trust model right you are supposed to show the moral principle and you are supposed to show the commitment if i have said that i will be available to indrashil university at 11 o'clock i will if i have said i will share this presentation to you people i am supposed to aisa nahi ki aaj maine kar diya taali baje logo chala gaya and then 
मैं भूल भी गया कि आप लोगों को देना है देन इट इज नॉट द कमिटमेंट एंड देर फॉर नॉट वेरी गुड यहाँ हम लोग ट्रस्ट जो है उसको ब्रीच कर दे राइट right? अगर ऐसे रिपीटेड एक्सपर्ट्स uh, लोग आते रहेंगे और अगर ऐसा ही बिहेवियर दिखा करेंगे कहीं ना कहीं आपको इस पूरे सिस्टम के ऊपर से ट्रस्ट निकल जाएगा आप बोलोगे प्रदीप जी लोगों को लेके तो आते हैं लेकिन ठीक है आई मीन वॉट ट्रस्ट डू वी बिल्ड फॉर हेल्प राइट वो बोलते हैं लेकिन बाद में वो तो हेल्प नहीं करते राइट सो इंटीग्रिटी इज समथिंग विच इज द सेकेंड वन एंड इंटीमेसी इज डेवलप बाई क्रिएटिंग शेयर एक्सपीरियंस राइट मुझे कुछ आता है मैं आपको सिखाता हूँ आप हमें आई आई टेल यू दैट आई एम आई एम नॉट कमिंग फ्रॉम अ वेरी हाई फाई यू नो ब्रांड ऑफ यूनिवर्सिटी ऑल दो लकीली आई गॉट एन अपॉर्चुनिटी टू टीच पीपल इन आई एम्स एंड आई आई टीज ऑल्सो बट टू बी वेरी ऑनर्स आई बिलोंग टू अ वेरी स्मॉल प्लेस कॉल एज भावनगर इन गुजरात राइट एंड वी वेर वेरी कॉन्शियस अबाउट हाउ वी विल बी एबल टू प्रोजेक्ट आवर सेल्स इन नाइनटीन so friends something which helped me a lot is the quality circle which i created around myself the quality friends the like minded friends that i have created uh, let me tell you that even after 20 22 years of uh, experience 99 i'm talking about aaj bhi we are living like a family we are so close friends we help each other in business we help each other in our professions we we still even today share feedback to each other and very tough feedback right not like aaj tumhara shot acha nahi lag raha hai hum bahut tough tarike se ek dusre ke sath mein feedback dete hain but we believe that that is something which has brought us at the level that we are today right so create your shared experience with your other classmates and be a person be a human a something who cares about people this is how you actually develop the intimacy so if you really want to develop trust among your uh, universe and your environment develop competence develop integrity develop intimacy right and and trust me without trust no relationship exists right so i have given you how you can develop this this one single slide my friends can actually make you right right so please please practice this yeah the second uh, thing which can help you in building your uh, interpersonal is daniel goleman's emotional quotient jisko hum log emotional intelligence bhi bolte hain right uh, uh, this is he is the gentleman who has invented that sirf technical skills jo hai usse aadmi aage nahi badhta So you actually uh, stay successful in your life with emotional intelligence because ultimately you have to deal with people. All that you do is with people and not with the machineries, right? And therefore, having emotional intelligence is very very important. He said that how do we do that? First, you develop your awareness around yourself. I am going to explain to you that how do we develop self awareness? Develop how do we do it? Right? So you you develop your self awareness. once you develop your self awareness once you know about your strengths your weaknesses then you try and understand ki agar ye mere weaknesses hai main usko kaise manage kar sakta right and then you go and try and understand others and this is how you build a, a universe of relationship around you yeah ye bahut bahut hi detailed concept hai uh, iske upar log do do din ka program karte hain sirf ye ek slide ke upar i have just kind of given you an orientation of uh, because uh, इमोशनल इंटेलिजेंस जो है वो भी एक बहुत ही इंपॉर्टेंट पिलर है अबाउट योर इंटरपर्सनल स्किल द थर्ड थिंग ऑफ कोर्स इज योर यू नो बॉडी लैंग्वेज सो यू सी देर आर वेराइटी ऑफ वेज दैट पीपल आर शेकिंग द हैंड्स ईच ऑफ दिस हैंड शेकिंग हमारे पास टाइम नहीं अदर वुड हैव एक्चुअली एक्सप्लेन ईच ऑफ दिस हैंड शेकिंग हैज इट्स ओन मीनिंग राइट देर आर सम हैंड शेक वेयर द हैंड इज अब द अदर पर्सन हैंड sometimes you have the palms open sometimes you pull another uh, your hand onto the body of the other person sometimes you crush the opposite person's hand there are variety of uh, ways all these handshakes are actually showcasing your own pattern of behavior and how do you deal with other people right body language is is a subject uh, where you need to actually it actually uh, an additional component that helps you understanding personalities of other people intentions of other people right so uh, at one end you should 
use body language to understand other at another end you should also ensure that your own body language speaks the right message body language ka problem kya main aapko bata deta hu aapka jo communication jo hai right wo communication mein jitni cheez aap muh se express nahi kar pate ho wo automatically aapka body kar deta hai that's the body language and therefore you are supposed to learn Uh, you know that what are the right because people not only listen to you and your words people also see you and both that thing all put together they perceive you. and therefore body language is something which is very very important now the fourth element through which you can actually develop your interpersonal is by understanding people and their behavior their psychology their personality right so a uh, uh, simple sa concept hai on personality which probably will you uh, which will uh, helpful to you and useful to you is on the theory of a, a famous gentleman called as william marston uh, shayad aap log aage ja ke uh, kabhi sunoge uh, a tool called as disc okay which is uh, run by various institution including another uh, including the one which is called as thomas international okay so uh, again personality mein there are two theories uh, there are some people who have developed something called as types theory some people have developed the trait theory itna at this moment aapko samajhne ka zarurat nahi hai but what is what is uh, very important for you to uh, understand is that agar aapko samne wale ki personality samajh mein aa gayi to aap uski personality ke hisab se apne aap ko change kar sakte ho अपने आपके बिहेवियर द वे यू कनेक्ट विद दैट पर्सन आप उसको चेंज कर सकते हो और उससे आप एक बहुत ही अच्छा बेटर कनेक्ट सामने वाले के साथ में ला सकते हो सो so, एक सिंपल uh, तरीके से बीइंग अ स्टूडेंट जो आप बहुत आसानी से समझ सकते हो तो आई थॉट दैट आई विल एक्सप्लेन इन इन दिस वे थिंक ऑफ आपको क्या करना है जितने भी लोग सपोज आप आप ऐसा एक्चुअली प्रैक्टिस कर सकते हो कि आपके क्लास में जितने भी स्टूडेंट्स हैं आपके फ्रेंड्स हैं उनको आप चार अलग अलग कैटेगरी में डिवाइड कर दो नाउ सम पीपल हु आर वेरी पीसफुल एंड फ्रेंडली राइट दे आर एक्चुअली लाइक अ डॉग राइट द सेकंड वन इज समबडी हुम यू फील दैट आर वेरी वाइज एंड वेरी लॉजिकल बड़े थिंकर टाइप के लोग हैं लॉजिकल डिसीजन लेते हैं काफी एनालिटिकल है उनको आप आवल कैटेगरी में डाल दो देन there are people who likes to wear you know good outfit uh, unko unko kuch dikhane ka bahut acha lagta hai unko stage performance dena bahut acha lagta hai logo ko attract karna bahut acha lagta hai right who are basically showing showy and optimistic to unko ek teesri category mein dal ko jisko aap bologe peacock right and then the fourth one who is very bold very decision leader jo challenge pasand karte ho right उनको आप चौथी कैटेगरी में डाल दो ईगल राइट सो देर आर फोर कैटेगरीज यू हैव टू पुट पीपल ऑन डव ऑवल पीपल पीकॉक एंड ईगल नाउ लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड ईच ऑफ दिस सो डव आर बेसिकली द पीपल हु आर वेरी सपोर्टिव वेरी पेशेंट डिप्लोमेटिक डिप्लोमेटिक इज बिकॉज़ दे नो हाउ टू काइंड ऑफ यू नो मैनेज दे हैव गुड इयर्स पेशेंस से लोगों को सुनते हैं सो देयरफॉर दे कैन बिकम अ वेरी गुड डिप्लोमेट किसी के दो के बीच में झगड़ा होता है तो दे आर द बेस्ट पीपल जो दोनों को साथ में लेके आते हैं दे आर वेरी पीपल ओरिएंटेड दे आर वेरी लॉयल फ्रेंडली एंड हार्ड वर्किंग राइट दैट्स द काइंड ऑफ अ कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स दैट दे आर हैविंग लेकिन अगर इसके साथ आपको एक अच्छे से जेल uh, करना है तो आप कैसे कर सकते हो सो नंबर 1 दे लाइक अप्रूवल अप्रूवल मींस उनको ज्यादा रिजेक्शंस पसंद नहीं है दे वांट पीपल टू सपोर्ट दे लाइक दैट पीपल रिस्पेक्ट देम राइट they like that people recognize them ka are yaar ye kaam aapne kiya bahut acha kiya aapne you know they like these kind of words they like security agar unko insecurity lagega ki aapne film dekhne chale gaye unko chhod ke do bari unko aisa lagega ki aap usko dur kar rahe ho usse unko insecurity feel hogi unko acha nahi lagega and uh, they like the attention matlab wo agar char cheez class mein koi presentation de rahe hain please be attentive unko aap kisi dusre ke sath baat karoge to disturb ho jata hai right so this is how you can actually gel well with those people who are showing dow kind of characteristics right the second one is owl so owl people are very analytical type of people they are very neat tidy generally unko 
लोगों के साथ बहुत घुलना मिलना पसंद नहीं होता और उनको बड़ा टाइम टेबल बनाएंगे स्केड्यूल के साथ जाएंगे बड़े ही डिटेल रहेंगे दे आर वेरी स्ट्रक्चर्ड दे लाइक एवरीथिंग इन द परफेक्ट वे वेरी एनालिटिकल एंड वेरी एक्टिव राइट दिस इज द काइंड ऑफ पीपल दे आर ओके आप अगर उनके पास कुछ भी एक डॉक्यूमेंट लेके जाओगे उनकी ये एबिलिटी रहती है उसमें से चार गलती आपको निकाल के देंगे राइट right? ये इनकी एबिलिटी रहती है ना इनके साथ कैसे काम कर सकते हैं राइट ये डिसीजन को सपोर्ट करते हैं डोंट पुश देम टू टेक डिसीजन डिसीजन आपको लेना पड़ेगा वो आपको डिसीजन लेने के लिए डेटा दे सकते हैं नंबर टू उनको अपनी स्पेस चाहिए राइट right? अभी देखिए कई बार सिबलिंग्स आप एक साथ अगर रहते हैं तो कुछ आपके भाई या बहन ऐसे होते हैं जो ज्यादातर मिक्स एंड मैच नहीं होते उनको अपना एक कोना चाहिए रहता है सो डोंट पुश देम कि यार हमारे साथ ये करो और तुम तो यू नो सो दीज आर द काइंड ऑफ पीपल जो अपनी दुनिया में रहना जानते हैं और उनको वही अच्छा लगता है ज्यादा द थर्ड थिंग इज दैट दे ऑल्सो लाइक टू बी रिस्पेक्टेड अबाउट द डेटा दैट दे आर प्रेजेंटिंग राइट दे लाइक एक्टिविटीज दे लाइक प्रोसेस राइट दे लाइक एग्जीक्यूशन एंड दे आर वेरी ट्रांसपेरेंट दे आर वेरी क्लियर वो आपको कुछ भी फीडबैक लेने के लिए दीज आर वन ऑफ द बेस्ट पीपल राइट एंड दे आर वेरी पॉजिटिव सो दीज आर द काइंड ऑफ पीपल हु लाइक्स डेटा दीज आर द काइंड ऑफ पीपल हु लाइक्स डिटेल्स आप उसको कुछ बताओगे तो वो आपको डिटेल में बहुत सारे क्वेश्चन करेंगे सो यू विल हैव टू बी रेडी विद आंसर्स बिकॉज जब तक कि उनके अंदर पूरी इंफॉर्मेशन बैठ नहीं जाती है उनको वो कंफर्ट लेवल नहीं आएगा The third category of people, peacock, are basically expressive. अब ये वो लोग हैं जो बहुत enthusiastic होते हैं They are very communicative, magnetic, very creative. They are very positive and optimistic about everything. The problem with them is they are very talker. और एक बार बात करना चालू करने के आपको मतलब वो खत्म नहीं होता They are very people person. उनका क्या है कि they get energy from people. उनको अकेले मजा नहीं आता है right? So, ऐसे लोगों को आप अच्छे जेल कैसे कर सकते हो उनसे अच्छा काम कैसे ले सकते हो सो so, ऐसे लोगों को आपको प्लेटफॉर्म देना है मतलब कुछ भी अगर है तो आप बोलो कि यार ये आप ही लीड करो आप अच्छे से कर सकते हो <coughs> उनको आप लोगों के साथ में काम करने का देते जैसे हमने आवल का बोला था उनको अकेलापन ज्यादा पसंद है इको उनसे बिल्कुल उल्टे हैं उनको लोगों के साथ काम करना पसंद है राइट right? उनको वैरायटी बहुत पसंद है मतलब एक ही चीज आप उनके साथ बार बार करोगे ना तो वो बोर हो जाते हैं सो यू विल हैव टू गिव देम डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ वर्क यू विल हैव टू गिव देम वैरायटी इन देयर लाइफ राइट उनको भी रिकॉग्निशन बहुत पसंद है दे आर वेरी क्रिएटिव तो उनको क्रिएटिव काम ज्यादा पसंद है आप उनको आवल वाला मैथमेटिकल काम दे दोगे तो उनको बिल्कुल पसंद ही आएगा आवल को बहुत पसंद आएगा पीकॉक जो है उनको क्रिएटिव काम पसंद आते हैं उनको वन प्लस वन टू कभी नहीं होता है आप उनको बोलो वन प्लस वन इलेवन करके दिखा वो दिखा देगा आपको एंड दे लाइक टू बी फ्लैक्सीबल एंड दे आर ऑल्सो वेरी फ्लैक्सीबल राइट सो दिस इज अबाउट पीकॉक एंड हाउ यू कैन वर्क विद दीज काइंड ऑफ पीपल एंड द लास्ट वन इज द ईगल हु आर बेसिकली द ड्राइवर्स राइट दीज आर द पीपल हु आर डिसिव दे आर वेरी बोल्ड दे डोमिनेट ओके उनको ये लगता है कि लोगों को मैं कंट्रोल करूं, राइट दे आर वेरी ब्लंट स्टबल एंड वेरी हाईली एनर्जेटिक मतलब अगर आप किसी रेस्टोरेंट में आज पूरा ग्रुप को खाना खाने जाने का डिसीजन है तो ईगल वुड लाइक कि वो प्लान करें कहाँ जाना है क्या खाएंगे कैसे करेंगे सो द अथॉरिटी हैज टू बी विद दिस पर्सन ना इनके लिए प्रॉब्लम क्या है कि आप uh, उनको चैलेंज करोगे तो वो और ज्यादा अच्छे से काम करेंगे सो दे लाइक चैलेंज उनको आपको पावर देनी पड़ेगी आप बोलोगे कि यू आर वन ऑफ द पर्सन और ड्राइव तो हम करेंगे तो वो उनको वो चीज पसंद नहीं आती फिर वो क्या करेंगे आपको चैलेंज करना चालू कर देंगे आपकी पोजीशन को चैलेंज करना चालू कर देंगे तो उनको आपको कुछ रिस्पांसिबिलिटी uh, देनी पड़ेगी राइट दे लाइक द पोजिशन दे लाइक रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी दे लाइक ऑथोरिटी दे लाइक फ्लेक्सीबिलिटी तो ये वो लोग हैं जो इंडिपेंडेंट नेचर के लोग हैं उनको आप काम दे दो अपने हिसाब से करके आपको दे देंगे राइट दीज आर दीपल जो कोई जब नहीं कर सकता है दीज आर दीपल राइट सो दिस इज विलियम मार्सन की बहुत इंटरेस्टिंग थियोरी है जिसको डिस्क में से फिर बाद में किसी ने इजी अंडरस्टैंडिंग के लिए चार वर्ड में कन्वर्ट करके दे दिया राइट बट दिस इज समिंग विच इज वेरी यूजफुल आप 
ठंडे दिमाग से सोचोगे तो आप पूरी दुनिया को ये चार चीजों में आप बांट सकते एंड देन यू कैन एक्चुअली लर्न हाउ टू वर्क वेल विद दोज पीपल yeah so that's that's about uh, how do we work with different personalities when it comes to communication in the very beginning uh, one of our students says communication yes but please i want to just clarify one thing communication teen tarike ke hote hain friends and jab hum interpersonal ki baat karte hain to we have to understand ki aggressive communication doesn't work because wo kai bar samne wale ko pain deta hai hurt karta hai passive will also not work बिकॉज पैसिव कम्युनिकेशन में क्या होता है कि लोगों को लगता है कि आपको इंटरेस्ट ही नहीं है राइट right? और अगर आपको इंटरेस्ट है भी तो भी उनको ये लगेगा कि भाई इसको ग्रुप में रखने को कोई फायदा ही नहीं है बिकॉज इसका तो कोई ओपिनियन ही नहीं होता राइट सो द थर्ड कैटेगरी ऑफ कम्युनिकेशन विच इज कॉल्ड एज असर्टिव कम्युनिकेशन इज द राइट वे वेन इट कम्स टू इंटरपर्सनल डेवलपमेंट राइट सो प्लीज डेवलप योर असर्टिव कम्युनिकेशन right uh, you probably can uh, find out some reading around how to develop assertive communication yeah and uh, the last one is uh, how do we manage conflict so remember ye jo pehle hum logo ne win win situation i am okay you are okay wagera jo dekha tha kahin se wahi cheez jo hai wo thomas kilman ne ek alag model mein usko diya कि व्हेन यू आर इन टू अ निगोशिएटिंग प्रोसेस और व्हेन यू आर इन अ कॉन्फ्लिक्टिंग प्रोसेस देयर आर टू एलिमेंट्स दैट यू आर यूजिंग वन इज योर असर्टिवनेस एंड सेकंड इज योर यू नो सेकंड इज योर कोऑपरेटिवनेस राइट सो दिस साइड यू कैन सी इज द असर्टिवनेस एंड दिस साइड यू कैन सी इज द कोऑपरेटिवनेस सो व्हेन यू गो अप and when you increase your assertiveness and you decrease your cooperativeness you become competent or you not competent sorry you you become competing which means ki aap apna hi point of view ko pakad ke rehte ho samne wale ka nahi sunoge isse relationship acche honge nahi honge right number 2 ya fir kabhi aap kya karoge cooperativeness ko ekdam bada doge assertiveness ko ghata doge to isse kya hoga you will become very accommodating फ्रेंड्स अकोमोडेटिंग से सामने वाले को तो अच्छा ही लगेगा लेकिन एट द एंड धीरे धीरे जाके आप जो है वो स्प्रिंग की तरह एकदम दब जाओगे और एक ना एक दिन आपका स्प्रिंग भी उछल पड़ेगा राइट अगेन इवेंचुअली वो कहीं ना कहीं आपके रिलेशनशिप को खराब कर देगा और आपको बेसिकली वो अनहैप्पी करेगा जो हम नहीं चाहते थर्ड थिंग इज अगर हम दोनों को कम कर देंगे तो आप अवॉइडिंग सिचुएशन में आ जाओगे मतलब कि मुझे इसके साथ काम करना ही नहीं है तो कई बार लोग नौकरी छोड़ देते हैं कई बार लोग रिलेशनशिप को छोड़ देते हैं दैट इज बेसिकली अवॉइडिंग जब भी आप एक दूसरे की बेस्ट चीजों को लेके जब डिस्कशन नहीं कर सकते हो तभी आप अवॉइडिंग सिचुएशन में आ जाए आप एक दूसरे से अलग हो जाते हैं द फोर्थ वन इज कॉल्ड एज कॉम्प्रोमाइजिंग मतलब सारी चीज जो है उसको थोड़ा थोड़ा कम करके जब भी आप करोगे तो आप कॉम्प्रोमाइज कॉम्प्रोमाइजिंग में टू सम एक्सटेंड लोग ठीक ठाक रहते हैं इट्स लाइक किसी आप मैंगो लेने गए उसने बोला सौ रुपये के डजन आपने बोला नहीं मैं पचास डजन पचहत्तर रुपये आपने खत्म किया वन वे ऑफ लुकिंग एट इट आपने खत्म कर दिया बट अनदर वे ऑफ लुकिंग एट इट ना उसको सौ मिला ना आपने पचास में खरीदा सो दोनों ने कॉम्प्रोमाइज किया द बेस्ट सिचुएशन देर फॉर इज दैट यू हैव बेस्ट ऑफ योर असर्टिवनेस एंड यू हैव बेस्ट ऑफ योर कोऑपरेटिवनेस सो दैट यू हैव अ बेटर कलबरेटिंग डिस्कशन राइट जहाँ पर कोई आर्ग्यूमेंट नहीं होगी कोई कॉम्प्रोमाइज नहीं होगा कोई पेनफुल या हर्ट नहीं होगा ओनली एंड ओनली फ्रूटफुल रिजल्ट मिलेगा थ्रू प्रॉपर कलेबरेशन राइट सो विद द थॉमस किलवन मॉडल व्हाट इट सेज इज कलेबरेटिंग इज द हाउ लेट मी आल्सो टेल यू दैट इन एवरी सिचुएशन कलेबरेटिंग मे आल्सो नॉट पॉसिबल ओके आप आप एयरपोर्ट पे गए हो और पूरा क्यू लगा हुआ है सडनली कोई बीच पे घुस जाता है वहां आप कोलोबरेटिंग नहीं कर सकते बट इन जनरल जहां पर रिलेशनशिप आपके लिए बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है certainly you would like to invest your time there and therefore this model okay so this is i hope that uh, conflict management style is something which is very famous model as like uh, daniel goleman's model of uh, emotional intelligence this is also equally very important and very famous model right ye jitne bhi concepts theories or model maine koshish ki hai yahan pe lane ki is all because ye sari sari cheeze bahut famous hai Uh, well accepted across the globe and people do practice this 
the only thing probably that you will have to do is you will have to have a deeper reading on these things and then you have to try and implement that into your real, real life situation right so that was all about what are the different components can help you to build your interpersonal the last 5 minutes that i want to talk about is how do we build this right aap bologe ye sab samajh mein aa gaya lekin ab main karu kya kaise karu okay so thoda sa aapko main yahan pe help karne ki koshish kar raha hu number one my friend is that you will have to develop your competency around your interpersonal competency made of three things knowledge skill behavior नॉलेज आपको बुक्स से मिलेगा नॉलेज आपको आपके गुरु से मिलेगा स्किल्स जब भी आप उस नॉलेज को आपके फ्रेंड सर्कल में इंप्लीमेंट करना चालू करोगे और वो जो एक्सपीरियंस से आप सीखोगे जो डेवलप करोगे वो आपकी स्किल बनेगी और बिहेवियर उससे बनेगा कि जब भी आप कॉन्शियसली उस चीज को अपने अंदर ऑब्जर्व करोगे फीडबैक लोगे और उसको बार बार ठीक करने की कोशिश करोगे दैट विल बी योर राइट बिहेवियर so your competency which is made of knowledge skill and behavior jab bhi aap usko interpersonal pe develop karoge you will be right there the second thing is you remember i had talked about in the beginning about yes. your self awareness so self awareness is basically uh, daniel goleman ke model mein humne bola tha ki you need to know about yourself also main kaise karta hu right jo maine char personalities ki baat ki agar aapko apni personality samajhni hai to there are tools available right so just for your knowledge there are tools like big five belbin uh, yes. uh, like big five is a trait theory belbin is like you know in a group or collaborative situation how you can uh, identify your strengths and weaknesses this can mbti are based on types theory uh, which tells you that you are this type of a person or you are that type of a person but any of this you can pick up jab bhi aapko kabhi mauka milega right you can pick up you can Uh, get yourself assessed and you have a detailed report out of it right so uh, you can have self awareness this way uh, second if in case uh, you wish to develop your collaborative uh, skills uh, i mean you know some of these things i have explored so therefore i can share there is an institution called as iceps okay indian society of applied behavioral science uh, they uh, they uh, have an institution which is a non profit institution in india and uh, us may be an ntl karke what they do is they create laboratories human process laboratories you be a part of it you exchange feedback and you learn more about yourself right so i said say sumeda landmark ye sab bhi kahin na kahin usi tarike ka kaam karte hain uh, you can also read books you can have videos these days available on youtube you can also so jitne bhi concepts by the way maine bole hain इसमें से मेजोरिटी आपको यूट्यूब में भी मिल जाएंगे राइट देर आर ऑडियो बुक्स पॉडकास्ट पे सो ऑल दोज रिसोर्सेज आर योर पीपल आर वेरी लकी ऑल दिस रिसोर्सेज आर अवेलेबल दीज डेज यू कैन हैव इजी लर्निंग राइट एंड फाइनली ऑन द बुक्स पार्ट अगर इंटरपर्सनल के रिलेटेड आपको कभी कुछ यू नो इन स्ट्रक्चर में सीखना है दीज आर सम ऑफ द बुक्स यू नो द सेवन हैबिट्स ऑफ हाईली इफेक्टिव पीपल ये हमारे childhood ke time pe hai but this is one of the best book that i always suggest everyone uh, how to win friends and influence people by dale carnegie uh, men are from mars and women are from venus uh, maybe kabhi aap shaadi wadi karoge to pehle ye pad lena chahiye uh, guarantee kisi cheez ki nahi hai but you still can read that uh, then daniel goleman ka ek aur social intelligence and emotional intelligence do books hai unki wo bhi bahut bahut uh, uh useful books hai these are the books friends which are purely purely written focusing on how do you connect yourself how do you engage yourself with others and make sense in your relationship so that's all about uh, friends from my end and i am open to uh, invite questions uh, if there is any uh, i'm stopping this over here and available for your questions uh sir before we have uh, reflections or questions in the chat box uh, i express my heartfelt thanks to you sir because it was a complete package where you have uh, shared the concepts theories models and uh, assessment of our in own personality
and that too while relating with this uh, birds you know uh, in fact we were not trying to assess but we are trying to find you know person who is related to peacock or owl or this you know mm -hmm. this is what you know the assessment was going yes. on that which person you know falls in this category right. and when you said you are from bhavnagar uh, for your you know information uh, bharti madam is also from bhavnagar oh. so bhavnagar is no more and she has you know served in uh, the university there uh, for over 27 years oh, so wow. bhavnagar wale bhav wale hote hain so no matter whether they have you know uh, studied from a big or small university what matters most absolutely, is uh, skill what you said knowledge and the behavior so yes, yes. Uh, now over to uh, vinan sir for uh, his review and um, his you know feedback on the session no I, I will say the very informative session not only for our students for also our faculty also because i would like someday parag bhai to visit here and have a specific pleasure only with our faculty and if he can do some firo b survey with our oh. faculty, then it will be useful because i have been chasing with somebody who can do that for our faculty because you know that's sure. will them inside thing uh, team building session if you can do that probably you can invite him in first week of october any saturdays Sure, sure, definitely. I'll, I'll try my level best to, and it will be, of course, my pleasure to to be with you. Uh, Firobi is something, of course, that we we learned in the very beginning of, of our career. Yeah. Uh, one of the very fundamental tool that people use for. So, um, sure, sure, definitely. And, and in case if I come across any uh, tools which are uh, free and uh, which we can use for the students also for their own practice and understanding, yes, definitely. I'll definitely share it with you. Uh, sir, yes, there is one question which has popped up from Love Solanki. He is a B.Tech student, seventh semester, chemical engineering. He uh, is uh, having doubt, you know, how to win any argument without raising our voice. Oh, yes, sure. So uh, let me tell you that uh, number one, we have seen Daniel Coleman's uh, model, right? And it says that if you know your own limitations and your own strength. एंगर कभी आता है एंगर तभी आता है जब हमको नॉलेज नहीं है इफ यू हैव अवेयरनेस आपको कभी एंगर नहीं आएगा एंड यू विल बी एबल टू रिस्पॉन्ड टू द सिचुएशन राधर रिएक्टिंग टू सिचुएशन राइट आपका सवाल यही है कि हम रिस्पॉन्स कैसे करें राधर रिएक्ट एंड मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम जब भी अपने पास इंफॉर्मेशन नहीं होता है नॉलेज नहीं होता है हम लोग रिएक्ट करते हैं देर आर टू थिंग्स दैट वी नीड टू डू वन इज वी नीड टू नो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल अबाउट आर सेल्स right our ground is uh, clear or not whether we are arguing without any point or with point number 1 and number 2 is jo four world wala jo humne why i talked about it is because most of the time uh, we fail in understanding the emotional acceptance of the opposite person we gets into a wrong method with that person and that's how it actually converts into an argument so agar mere paas samne आवल टाइप का आदमी खड़ा है जिसको लॉजिकल आर्ग्यूमेंट ज्यादा पसंद है पर अगर मैं उसके साथ इमोशनल वाली बात करूंगा तो वो उसको रिजेक्ट ही करेगा राइट और इसीलिए फिर हमारे बीच में जो है वो झगड़े होंगे एंगर होगा चिल्लम चिल्ली होगा सब कुछ होगा राइट बिकॉज वी वॉन्ट टू प्रूव अवर पॉइंट सो वेन वी हैव अवेयरनेस फॉर सेल्फ एज वेल एज ऑफ अदर्स एंड वेन वी फाइंड इन आर वे ऑफ कनेक्टिंग विद दैट पर्सन दैट वे it definitely mujhe to ab tak ki wo definitely help kiya and it can definitely yeah i hope that i answered uh, sir very well answered sir uh, in fact we have to give a deep thought to all these models and concepts and theory perhaps thereby you know we'll be able to develop the healthy yes. relationship in fact what you talked about disc was also the one of the program which i attended uh, and i did that uh, certification course in uh, thomas profiling Sure. and i see reflections from students also a uh, very interesting and nice session so uh, i there is one Thank another question much. yes so shipra has yeah. asked sir how to convey any one elder or senior than us uh, when they are mistaking without making them feel disrespected very good question oh, yeah. very very good question very good question sir. and uh, uh, i tell you that uh, i also had some consulting stint and uh, i was uh, appointed for uh, rajkot nagrik sahakari bank this i'm talking about some 10 years back when i was called for uh, a program and we in fact had to assess some of the very senior people there uh, because they had to appoint 
टू थ्री हाई पोटेंशियल पीपल ऑन सीनियर पोजिशन बिकॉज दो तीन लोग रिटायर हो रहे थे कॉपरेटिव बैंक के सीनियर लोग मतलब हम समझ सकते हैं कि उसमें से पचास के नीचे कोई था ही नहीं और वो टाइम पे मेरी एज रहेगी आई थिंक अराउंड अभी का तो 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 यही क्वेश्चन जो है वो प्रोग्राम के प्रोग्राम के शुरू में देर वॉज डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ एक्सेप्टेंस और बाद में डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ एक्सेप्टेंस एंड द सेम क्वेश्चन वॉज आस्ट my answer is very simple on on this is uh, what a human being irrespective of any age expecting from you is that you respect and recognize that person my style the way it has worked for me is maine jab bhi meri umar se zyada umar wale logo ko ya to mere team members rahe hain meri company mein ya maine unko train kiya hai remember one thing that unke paas bhi unka ek experience hai जो शायद वो भी शायद आपसे चार चीजें ज्यादा जानते हैं लेट्स से फॉर एग्जांपल अगर मैं आज इंटरपर्सनल की बात कर रहा हूँ हो सकता है शायद इंटरपर्सनल मैंने थोड़ा स्टडी किया बराबर लेकिन इट मे बी पॉसिबल कि जैसे अभी हमारा सुमित जी का मुझे समझ में आया कि आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस के लिए जो है वो मेरे से ज्यादा अच्छा समझते हैं सो वेन यू रिकोगनाइज द Uh, you know ability knowledge skills and competence of people better than you you respect that part of that person that aapke paas ye acha hai mere paas ye acha hai main aaj aapko ye de raha hu because aapko chahiye so then there is no difference in terms of what uh, what is the age that one is carrying with right then it is completely objective ke irrespective of the age difference aaj hum ye seekhne ke liye saath mein baithe then you have no problem you have to respect the other person with their experience with their age and and all all the credentials that they are having in their career yeah. maybe sir we have to set the background inside and outside both ways that Absolutely. this is the uh, you know topic being you know uh, discussed today irrespective Absolutely. of their potentials and their experience and positions yeah correct correct uh, and uh, i i tell you like you know that uh, uh, we we do coaching and uh, we do coaching on the basis of the nlp background and how do we have this conversation because the moment you say ki because uh, kshipra ka uh, question ye tha ki unhone mistake ki hai jab kisi ne kuch mistake ki hai so you let the person think about what is their feeling and thinking level around that mistake rather you pointing out ki unhone mistake kiya right every person has their own realization right we have to have a process in the communication where you let the person realize about the mistake and let them have this wiseness about developing the thought ki main isko kaise theek karu because agar koi itna experience aadmi hai usko hum kya sikhane jayenge right we have all the experience with them you just have to have a process well that uh, discussion so that that person himself or herself decides that what should be done about it that's it बहुत बड़ा चैलेंज है सर लेकिन ये एक रियलाइज करवाना सेंसिटाइज करना बिकॉज ईगो कम्स इन बिटवीन जी सर एब्सोल्युटली एब्सोल्युट दैट्स एंड दैट इज व्हाट द लेवल वेयर वी हैव टू रीच देयर आर लॉट ऑफ फॉर्मल ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम्स व्हिच हैपेंस लाइक यू नो वेयर यू एक्चुअली लर्न हाउ टू हैव दिस काइंड ऑफ अ कन्वर्सेशन व्हिच इज बेसिकली द कोचिंग कन्वर्सेशन राइट सर थैंक यू सो मच सर सो मिस सर वुड यू लाइक टू से समथिंग या Ma'am, uh, really, uh, for answer it was very presentation. And you know, जब हम कोई ऐसी बात करते हैं जिसमें हम अपनी life से उसको relate कर सकते हैं, then we can we we can create interest in it. So what uh, I feel like, you know, हमने उस चीज को अपनी life से correlate किया और हमें interest create किया है. Like you said कि जैसे अभी आप बोला कि नॉलेज है एक हमारे प्रोफेसर को एंड ही हैज एक्सप्लेन वन थिंग लाइक ही हैज मेड टू सर्कल ऑन यू नो बोर्ड एंड वन सर्कल वाज बिग योर सर्कल एंड दिस इज माय सर्कल and my circle can be smaller than your circle your circle is bigger one but we can't compare we have two different circles when Absolutely. we can compare when i'm making that circle into in, in, into that circle only then Absolutely. we can compare so that this thing also i can go relate with the art so thank you sir thank you so much ji thank you 
sir uh, as a part of our you know uh, event uh, we invite one of the students for their reflection and vote of thanks so i invite ria ria you can unmute yourself good afternoon to one and all i am ria surendran from bsc biosciences today's session by parak sir was very effective because negotiating seemed a lot complex and difficult we have to interact with a number of people every day and so interpersonal skills are required i thank parak sir for this interesting and helpful session your words were so accurate and you explained in such a simple form thank you so much sir i also thank dr bharti dave ma'am dean of school of science dr amish vyasa dean of school of engineering all the faculties and management staff of indrashil university for arranging such a fruitful webinar last but not the least thank you all the attendees who participated and made the webinar more interesting and interactive my warm regards to everyone thank you sir this is the voice of thank students you, <laughs> thank you very much ria uh, and all the students yeah i am really very humbled and uh, uh, very honored and uh, uh, i really enjoyed thoroughly you know whatever that interactions we had very nice good questions have come up it shows your own interest uh, and and it was uh, it was really good interacting with all the faculty members as well so we much. are sir uh, humbled and privileged to be with you and uh, having you know enjoyed this session sir we request for that uh, uh, ppt if you can share i'll definitely and, share yeah, i'll definitely for the sake of students and certainly would like to see you on the campus and uh, in the shil yeah. university wishes you safety and health namaskar thank you very much namaskar. thank you very much jai hind thank you so thank you thank you very much sir thank you